What's up team? Welcome to Training Camp. I'm Coach Ari from Training Camp Fitness and I'm going to be leading you through this workout today. Today's workout is all about that lower body, but we're also going to throw in some back today. So I have a feeling this is going to be one of your new favorite ways to train some hamstrings and your back. Um, we do have a bunch of lower body exercises in the library, but wanted to give you a giant set that would work more than just the legs and the glutes. So we're gonna focus on some hamstrings, some quads, and some back. So you will need a variety of weights. As you can see, um, I've got eights, tens, and twelves here today, but you can really use anything your little heart desires. As you know, I always encourage you to go heavier than you think that you can. Today's rep count is gonna be 10 reps each, and we're gonna do five moves. So it's going to be a really nice quick workout, great way to get your lift in and you're going to get a lot of bang for your buck. We like that around here. Okay, so I'm going to go through all five moves and we're going to get started. So you can just follow along with me and the first round, get a feel for the weight choices and then make any adjustments from there. Let's get started. We're going to start with a sumo squat to upright row. And I'm gonna grab these eights. We're gonna bring our feet nice and wide. They don't have to be too wide, but you need some clearance. And we're gonna do 10 reps. So the thighs track over the toes. We're gonna to squat down and explode up. Today is gonna to be with power. So you can use a heavier weight choice. That's three. Okay, join me when you're ready. 10 is gonna go pretty quick today. Okay, it's a express workout. Last three. Two, elbows up, kind of like you're zipping up your coat, and last one. Now we've got neutral full thrusters. This is definitely one that you can do a heavier weight choice with. Surprise, there's cardio in this workout, okay? We're gonna work through each move, back to back, squatting down, heavy in the heels. You're gonna explode up, and you're gonna keep the weights at your shoulders. So a full thruster, that's three, has the weights at your shoulders, and you're coming all the way down into a full squat. Beautiful. That's four, three, two, last one. Beautiful job. Okay, the next move, you have elevated narrow squats. So what you can do is take a book or some weights. I've got weights today. And what you're gonna do, you're gonna take one or two weight choices. You can hold one heavy weight at your chest, or you can hold both weights at your shoulders. So we're gonna bring the weights on our shoulders, okay? This is one that you can really go heavy with today. We have a not very heavy rep count. Okay, so the heels are elevated. Now one thing to watch here is that your knees are not caving in. So they're going over your toes, really working more of your quads, and we're strengthening your knees here as well. It's really good to do some knee-focused exercises. We don't think that we need them, but experienced athletes really benefit from this kind of training. Beautiful, last two. You're gonna hear me breathing a lot today. <laughs> last one, that's when you know it's leg day. Whew, put the weights down. Okay, next is a hip hinge swing. So you're gonna need something kind of heavy. You can use a dumbbell for this, or you can use a kettlebell. Let's do it. 10 here. So I'm gonna use a weight. I'm gonna move this guy out of the way. Okay, clear your space. Our hip hinge swing. We're gonna target the hamstrings. Two, snap up. You can use a really heavy weight here. Okay, bring your head down. And when I snap up, stop. Five, four, three, two, and one. Beautiful. All right, time for some heavier weights here. You're gonna feel this one in your glutes. We're coming down for a gorilla low row today. All right, I'm gonna face this way so you can see kind of my front and my side. I'm gonna come down into like a catcher's position really low, I've got two weights here, and what I'm gonna do is then stick my butt up in the air, kind of like a deadlift, and we row. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, 
eight, nine, let's keep going, 10, okay? What we're gonna do here, we're gonna double the rep count because it's single-sided. You're like, what, my quads are on fire already? That's five more, four, sit low, three, stick your butt out, two, last one. Woo -hoo -hoo. Hello, quads. That's it, five moves in the bank. You're gonna grab your water. Don't stand up too fast. You get a head rush like I did. <laughs> and make sure you have some type of nutrition in your water, BCAAs. Maybe a clean pre-energy. That's good, pre-workout, okay? So there you have it. Now you can adjust your weights. 10 is not a lot. This is an express workout. You should be going very heavy today. Sumo squat to upright row is limited by the shoulders, so whatever your upright row is, but you could always go up two to five pounds because it's power, okay? So we've got that power today. Let's start from the top, bring the feet wide. Okay, the weights come down and the elbows come up, nice and wide. Okay, like you're ripping apart a bag right here. Whew. Rip it apart, beautiful, that's it. So we're already halfway through, five, four, three, two, last one, perfect. You can keep those weights or grab something heavier. Moving on to neutral full thrusters. This workout should get your heart rate up for the whole set and that's when we rest, okay? We go back to back, five, five moves, back to back, good. Okay, my toes slightly out. That's my comfortable squat. Three, two, push them up there, explode, one. Good, elevated narrow squats. Remember you can hold one weight, but we're gonna keep these weights right next to each other. There's only about an inch of space. Whew, this is my workout today, absolutely. Bring the weights on the shoulders. Okay, you can do this and just hook them there or hold something heavy. Grab 25 pounds if you have it. I know sometimes we're limited at home. You're like, Ariana, I don't need a 25 pound weight. Well, you better get your butt to Dick's Sporting Goods and grab a 25 pound weight set because you're gonna use it. Maybe you just want one for squats. Four. I think we're over our count, sorry guys. This is what happens. Two, last one, you get extra reps. Extra reps, okay, moving right on. Grab your big weight, kettlebell if you want, hip hinge swing. We go, heart rate's up, keep it up. Torching calories, building beautiful lean muscle at the same time, we like that. Okay, at the bottom, lift your toes a little bit. You'll feel more hamstring activation. Try to keep your legs straight. Just a slight bend, you can see I have three, two, one, snap. Very good, very good. Gorilla low row, okay? We're gonna do 20 reps. You're like, what the hell? I tricked you. <laughs> okay, so squat down, nice and wide. You wanna avoid the knees caving in here. So I'll face you for this one, okay? I'm gonna squat down, lift my butt up, and I'm gonna row. You're like, this is very awkward. Well, yes, yes it is. <laughs> it's definitely a weird move, but the second you sit low, you're like, oh, I'm reminded of my catching days when they stuck me to be catcher when nobody else could do it, and that was the day. You said I'm never playing softball again. <laughs> At least for me, I hated playing catcher. It was awful. I don't know how they do it. Five, four, three, two, last one. Woo, stand it up nice and slow. Shake out the legs, shake them out, shake them out. Excellent, your goal, three to four rounds with our giant set, okay? Three to four rounds, not a lot of time. You get to decide your rest break. You know, I always recommend 30 to 60 seconds. Okay? Who's sweating? I am. Good job, team. High fives all around.
around. Take your dance break, whatever you need. We're going to the top, round number three. Sumo squat to upright row. Love these, they really get the heart rate up. Pick those 10 pounds up, girl. You got 12s, pick them up. That's it, three, explode up. Feet do not have to be super wide. It's up to you, you are gonna feel this in your inner thighs tomorrow. Last two, last one, perfect. Perfect, perfect, okay. We're going to those neutral full thrusters. I'm gonna keep these weights in my hand. They're already here. Remember, you can also do a half thruster. So let's go right into it. You don't have to sink all the way down low. Woo. Okay, from the side, you can see how low I'm going. This is a good range of motion for me. Find what works for you. Last three, last two, last one. Yeah, baby. Elevated narrow squats, we're in it. We're in it to win it. I'm proud of you. Showed up today. All you need, you could do this workout with one set of weights and then take it, take the workout outside. Take it with you, all right? We can work out anywhere. All right, heels elevated on a book or on top of some weights. Hook those weights right here and we go 10. The quads, whoo baby. Three, beautiful. Knees over ankles. It's okay if the knees pass the toes, that's okay. Four, stick with me, three. Yes, two, last one, you're a rock star. Woo -hoo. Okay, hold on to those weights. Move your prop aside. Gorilla, low row, on deck. Okay, right here, squatting down. Let's go, right into it, okay? Elbow comes back. My back is nice and flat, you can see, right? 10, nine, eight, sink lower, that's it. Last five, four, three, two, and one. Relax, shake them out, shake them out. Do your happy dance, get some water. Walk it out, walk it out. Holy moly, this is a good one. Every time, I make your workouts and then I do them, I go to film them, I'm reminded <laughs> why I have to use lighter weight choices because talking and your workouts at the same time, it's no easy feat. Are you ready for round number five? Let's do it. Grab your weights, remember, back to back to back. Maybe you grab something heavier here. This is your last round. Look at that, express lower body workout. Okay, got a little bit of shoulders there, a little bit of back action. You could absolutely pair this with our upper body bench workout as well. Love that express workout. Woo. Halfway there team, let's go. Keep working. You are a force to be reckoned with here. Remember, you can do hard things. Last three, last two, and last one, man, couldn't go very deep on that last one. Here we go, neutral full thrusters, straight away. Coming down, explode. Let the weights push you down, they should be heavy today. This should be hard to get the weights up here. Halfway, we got five, four, three, two, and one. Beautiful. All right, elevated narrow squat. I think last round I skipped your hip hinge swing, guys. I gypped you, I gypped you. Guess what? <laughs> We're gonna do more reps on this one, sound good? Okay, all right, bring these weights like, about just like a fist length apart, okay? Whoo, here we go. Narrow squats. 
We need to do more of these. This is gonna be your new favorite lower body workout. I know we love glutes on fire with the bands, but this one's money. Nice. Five, four, three, two, sink low. Last one. Oh my goodness. Cherry on top. Hip hinge swing. We're doing 20. We're doing 20. Yes, we missed out last time. Okay. Are you ready? That's it. Head comes down. You hike that football. That's it. Hold on to it tight. Don't let it go in front of you. That would not be good. We snap. That's it. Stop with the hips. Not a squat. A squat swing. So pick up at the bottom. You should be able to feel this right in the strings. Four, three, two, last one. Yes. Excellent job. We have one more move left. That gorilla low row. Let's get it, team. Let's get it. Pick up those heavy weights. I got my 12s on deck. Squat down. Butt up. <laughs> Knees out. Here we go. Flip your ponytail if you need to. We're getting nice and sweaty today, team. Breathe. My thighs are burning. Yes, they are. Butt lower. Butt lower. Butt back. Okay, stick the butt back. We got 10, 9, 8, 7. Keep going. Don't come up yet. 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Excellent job. Excellent job. Oh my goodness. I am so sweaty. I know you are too. That's it. If you're seeing stars, I'm right there with you. Woo! <laughs> awesome job today, team. You just completed four rounds of that giant set. Your get low giant set. Nice express workout. Real quick, feel free to pair this with another type of cardio workout. If you feel like you didn't get your heart rate up, 